Hi everyone! For my ETC 530 Playing with Design project, uh, I wanted to showcase a versatile tool in space that uh, I use every day in my teaching, and that's my, my desktop. Um, I realize that there's many other technologies that are connected to the desktop, from stuff like archived resources, data files, computer programs um, like PDF. Um, the internet itself is a source of information, and within that there's various forms of media that all feed through my computer and my projector, uh, and these are all core elements to, to my teaching. Uh, but I wanted to focus on my desktop as a tool um, that utilizes all these other tools and creates a space for clarity and for efficiency that, that helps me to engage my students and to, and to teach my students. Uh, so the best way I can show you this is with uh, elements of my Macbeth unit. I have my lesson, my notes, could be an activity here. This is just sort of uh, uh, annotated, pre-prepared annotations for Act, act 1. And I have uh, YouTube video if I wanted to utilize um, media like a, like a video um, I could do that I've got my scanned copy of the text on which I can highlight call attention to different elements um, and show pre-prepared notes and then last but not least, I have um, my audio setup. So we can listen as a class, we can listen to the play in certain sections. Um, and uh, as we listen, we can watch and, uh, and read. Uh, and I can toggle through all of this with the tab command buttons uh, on my Mac, my Mac keyboard. So if we were um, uh, working through this as, as a class, I would have everything set up. I might start with talking about the lesson or the activity, utilizing my resources um, here, which I would project and show to the kids. The kids would also have a, uh, have a printout of this. And then I might decide to jump to uh, looking at a particular actor scene. So we take a look at the play. In this case, it's Act 1, Scene 1. Uh, after I call that up, I have my audio here ready to go. And remember, all of this is enabled by placing everything on my desktop. That's that's my, my space for teaching and for showing and the space where I bring all of this media and all of this technology together um, to... to to, to help teach my kids. So we might listen to a little bit here. There we go. So we've listened to it and we could talk a little bit about it. I could show them my notes. And then we might decide that we wanted to reinforce that discussion, that teaching with um, some media. So I have my, um, my video, my YouTube video all queued up and I could play that for them. And then once we've watched the YouTube video, we can continue the discussion. We can move further through the play and discuss, um, um, discuss the next scene. Or we could jump to a new activity. Um, but presented this way, everything is, uh, everything is streamlined, everything is made uh, super efficient, which keeps kids engaged uh, and keeps them focused on, on uh, multiple many aspects of my, of my teaching that is presented in all one, one space. And that's all thanks to my computer desktop. So thank you very much for watching.